Good morning, good morning, good morning. Great day to be a Bronco. Today's a B day. It is Tuesday, April 21st. And I am coming to you from my beautiful office. I did run into the building this morning to record the morning announcements. I want to share several messages with you today. Uh, first and foremost, a big congratulations. Great job to all those students that were selected to the Governor Scholars School for the Arts, School for the Entrepreneurs, or the Scholars Program. We have several alternatives, or alternates, I mean, and just a lot of great kids, a lot of uh, competitive. Um, so congratulations to all of those students. I wanted to share something with the students that the teachers have been working on for several days now. Um, we've been in communication, we've been working behind the scenes, talking with our instructional leads and our administrators, and really um, wanted to uh, just share with you guys that we are going to begin on Fridays, just focusing on reteaching, focusing on reviewing, and making sure that everyone has had a chance to reassess or get caught up or have interventions, meeting times with teachers. Uh, we've asked, and our teachers are on board, that for Fridays, we are not going to introduce new material. So there's going to be no new content being taught, no new tasks being performed, but rather we are going to give you a day in which you can contact or be in communication with your teacher and ask questions to assignments that you may not be clear on or that you may need he extra help on. Uh, so that's one announcement I have for you today. Another announcement I have for you today is your ACT score is in. It is at ACT.org. You can get your ACT score right now. I don't have your ACT score yet. It hasn't made it through the district office and into the school level, um, but you can get your individual ACT score. You log on with the email that you used um, to register and the password, and you can go in there and get your uh, ACT score at this point. You'll see a lot of you guys are going to be very pleased with the ACT score because you practiced using Mastery Prep and you paid attention in class and you worked hard and you took it seriously. So if you did all those things, you're probably going to be better for it. And don't forget, you can still improve on your ACT score. Uh, the next announcement I have for you is I want you to pay attention to the screen I have shared with you here. And I'm going to get my mouse here. In the section that says NTI, that is the area, that is what we're doing now, the non-traditional instruction. We have set up for you additional support, additional help. So here you have all this great information pertaining to non-traditional instruction and NTI, but here is the new area, the NTI ESS. So during the school year, we have tutoring, we have ESS tutoring, and um, we wanted to duplicate an online version of this ESS tutoring. So let's see what it looks like. I'm gonna click that there, and it's going to spin and take me to what the NT, the NTSS, uh, NTI, new, new non-traditional instruction, sorry, and our ESS tutoring for our sessions. So during the school year, we had biomedical tutoring. We still will have biomedical tutoring, and it'll be through the Zoom meeting. You've got a password. You've got a meeting ID. Here is the English for folks that need English on Mondays and Thursdays, and we have a tutor on Wednesdays as well. If you need help with math, you've got math here on Mondays and Wednesdays with Mr. Green. You have math on Wednesdays and Thursdays with Ms. Burkett. You have science with Ms. Grossman. You click on this link. You go to that video conference and you share with that teacher what it is you're struggling with. And they will be able to help you, whether it's social studies, whether it's science, math, English, whatever the core content may be, we have these supports ready for you to go. Guys, this is the time when a lot of folks are making excuses. A lot of folks are looking around them and kind of using this social distancing as an opportunity to um, slack off. Um, but not you. 
you are focused, you are engaged, and you are really kicking it into high gear and taking advantage of this time together. Um, the last announcement I have for you today is that polleverywhere.com. I'm going to leave that poll up one more time and uh, uh, one more day, and I am going to ask that you, let me go here, go to polleev.com, and it sh should be popping up right away. Boom. Got it. And in polleev.com, today's poll question is, the F DHS archery team has earned many accolades and awards. Who holds the school record? We have no responses at the moment, so I encourage you to respond. <laughs> we have four different options for you to choose from, so please participate in that poll, and let's have some fun together. Also, if you have an idea for what this era should be called, shoot me an email. I'll put it on the poll, and we'll vote on that as well. I'm Lester Diaz, your principal, and it is an honor and a privilege to serve you in this capacity.